but uh, I, I, I hear, uh, are you are you a Spider-Man 2 fan? Yes, I am. The Sam Raimi movie, just so we're on the same page. Yes. Well, uh, I got your question. Uh, wh- why do you think it's a great movie? Let's just start there. Because it has no flaws. I'm sorry that there's a bunch of fanboys out there who will take anything they get, regardless of quality. Really? What, what do you consider a flaw? <laughs> what do I consider a flaw? An imperfection in the film. Quality, okay, well, script... Like, could you be specific? You could even like use The Last Jedi or something as an example. I don't think... I think it perfectly portrays the character of Peter Parker and Spider-Man. Okay. So you, you think... You, you basically think that the movie has no... What is your disagreement? Or... Do you think there's a better superhero movie than Spider-Man 2? Is that what you believe? Uh, yeah, I think there's several, but I also think Spider-Man 2, uh, despite me Okay, what movie? Give me one movie that you think, think is better than Spider-Man 2. Uh, okay, how about Guardians of the Galaxy 1 and 2? Goodbye. Goodbye. Guardians of the Galaxy 1 and 2? I'm sorry that some of you are so offended by someone who has a dissenting opinion, an opinion that is different from yours, someone who may not like the game just as much as you do or may not like the DLC as much as you do or may not even like the suit selection as much as you do. I'm sorry, that really messes with your emotions, you little soy boys. Better than Spider-Man 2? Goodbye, sir. But what I'm truly sorry for is that people in 2018 think that because they don't like what someone says, the best way to go about change is to completely silence those people. I will not even dignify that argument with a response. You beta 